Welcome back to Bossman Sports Cards here on Box or Collectibles. Today, we've got Minor League Monday. Now, as some of you may know, if you've seen the channel before, I actually work in Minor League Baseball with the Modesto Nuts. But one of the things that Gina and I do is we go around to all the different stadiums that we can in the time that we have. Uh, Brian, baseball cards, my uh, partner here at Box Score Collectibles, he also goes around to all the different stadiums that he can go to, which is a little bit easier for him now than for me because I've got 66 games where I'm doing the announcing for the Modesto Nuts. And he's a big Stockton Ports guy. So we have the 2024 Stockton Ports card set that was given out at the end of the season. And Gina and I, when we were in our travels around Texas a f uh, about a year ago, we went to the uh, Frisco Rough Riders Stadium. And we got some cards from that. 2023 Jack Leiter on the front. We all know he's up in the pros now, up in the big league. So let's have some fun here on our Minor League Monday. Well, it's a very well-sealed pack for the 2024 Stockton Ports. I'm going to be extremely careful to open this up. There we go. think I got it. Yeah. Don't want to bend at corners. Don't want to rip anything or cut into anything besides the plastic. But here we go. Maybe not the best way to... Uh, seal up the set but at least they got it out uh 2023 the stockton ports did not have a set come out uh as i was reminded when i was chatting with brian about doing this video uh i had forgotten that it was the 2024 set and i said 2023 on accident and that kind of started a discussion so now most minor league uh cards are done by um, choice sports cards, or used to be collector's choice or choice collectors, something like that. This set is not by, not done by them. Um, I guess they were running out of time, just went with the local group. And because of that, they couldn't sell the cards in the store. It's just a giveaway. So, Hey, we'll take full advantage and check out what the giveaway has in store for us here with the 2024 Stockton ports. Mark Adamiak, Luis Baez, the hitting coach, I believe, yep, that's some of our buddies there, that's a, a Chris Dunlap there in the background, very cool, I'm pretty sure Brian might actually be like behind the hitting coach, <laughs> so we'll keep an eye out for, see if our friends are in the pictures, okay, Ryan Brown, Akvaria, Ekavaria, yeah. Clark Elliott, outfielder, good young ball player. Uh, Jackson Finley, Joshua. Oh, how about Javier Goddard? Yeah, the manager. So these cards, because they were in that kind of wrapping, I guess they're a little bit stickier than uh, you would think. Now on the back. Like I said, they were at the end of the season, so they were able to get the 2024 season uh, stats on the back. Now, I don't know if this is the full season or part of the season. But Stockton Ports on the back, athlete's picture, some stats down here, information. Okay, apparently Josh was the around 375th, uh, third, third round pick, 75th pick overall out of Rutgers. Rodney Green, number eight. Okay, he was the fourth round pick. Nice. Hey, they got Jordy in here. Jordan Fennick, the general manager. Looks like he's throwing out a first pitch. Nice. Very cool. Okay, Nick Kurtz, Jose Dochera, Dochia, Docochia. That's one thing. Uh, yeah, I haven't heard some of these names. Either he's a middle reliever that didn't come into a game that we played against uh, when we played against him or something of that sort. Joseph Rodriguez, Alejandro Manzano, Dylan Montero. There we go. Miles Naylor. 
Bo Naylor's little brother. He was the 39th overall pick. Nice. In 2023 by the Athletics. Soon to be just Athletics, not Oakland Athletics. All right. Azuna, the pitching coach. Perform a uh, sports performance guy, Tom Reisinger, Elvis Rio, Nick Schwartz. Yes, I could not help myself when I announced his name. I'd be, may the Schwartz be with you after I would announce his name. Couldn't help it. <laughs> Su Chen Cha and Splash. Splash is the mascot. Okay, so species, the Delta creature, <laughs> resides in Stockton's deep water channel right outside of Banner Island Ballpark. Oh, funny stuff. <laughs> All right. And here we go. Yinyar Tour, Tommy White, Ron Whitmire, who, if I recall, uh, their hitting coach, Played for the Modesto A's. Um, let's see. He was originally drafted by the A's in the seventh round of the 88th first year player draft. He was he has coached at every level of baseball since the end of his five year playing career. Okay, so yeah, he was uh, he was in Modesto with the A's. Okay, Vic Zepian, clubhouse manager, Ryan Lasko, Micah Dallas, Nate Nankill. I mean, there's some good-looking photographs. You know, nothing bad about that. Some of the local teams have the best photographers. I don't know why Tops doesn't get a hold of them instead of doing all the stupid Photoshopping. Come on. We can do better, Tops. Look at some of these pictures. They're great. Utilize them. Stop Photoshopping. TJ Schofield Sam. Nelson Beltran. And finishing up, number 11, Luke Mann. So there you go. The 2024 Stockton Ports card set. Okay, signed as a free agent. There's Splash again, signed as a free agent. Let's see, round two, pick overall number 40. That's Thomas White, third base. Okay. Where did he go? Louisiana State. Whitmire, we talked about. Okay. Zapian, we talked about. Lasco, he was the round two, number 41 pick for a 2023 draft. Okay, out of 2022, round eight, Micah Dallas, the 244th pick. Nankill, he was the 196th pick in the 2023 draft. So, I mean, these are just, these are fun cards. They're great. Love it. Sleeve those up, have some fun, put them to the side. And now it's time to get into the Frisco Rough Riders 2023 set. All right. And yeah, going to have some uh, some of the Rangers on in this set. Okay, like Jack Leiter right off the bat. We saw him. Luis Sanyel Cuna. Yeah. Grant Anderson. Jax Biggers. Jax Biggers, he was originally from Missouri City, Texas. Uh, this one doesn't have where they were drafted or signed or whatever. Uh, just talks about the athlete. Card number four, Jax Biggers. We got Evan Carter. Yeah, that Evan Carter of the Texas Rangers. World Series champ, Evan Carter. Okay, Mark Church, Ricky DeVito, David Garcia. Once again, these are great pictures. Tops, work with us here. Great pictures. There is no need to Photoshop, Tops. 
Come on, get a hold of these guys early in the season. Just ask. Hey, you got some pictures of these guys? I'm sure they do. Dustin Harris, Trevor Hover, Scott Capers, Antoine Kelly, Nick Croth? Nick Croth. So the Rough Riders are out of Frisco, which is not far from uh, Arlington, if I recall, uh, in Texas. John Matthews, Theo McDowell, they are the double A, I believe, of the Texas Rangers. Tristan Pauly, Takoa Robbie. How about Thomas Sagers? Sagus? Sagus. Josh Sale. I mean, this is a great color scheme. You got some some uh, beige, you've got some silver, you've got some gold, you've got some burgundy, you got some blue. It's not actually a bad combo. I like it. Chris Sice, Justin Slayton, Alex Spees. I was actually at his debut game, which was against the Tampa Bay Rays. Nick Starr, Kellen Strom, Owen White. Grant Wolfram. Now, the 2022 stats, if they were there, he was 3-3 three and three with a 4.4 ERA. Not bad. The manager, Carlos Cardoza. John Goble as the uh, pitching coach. Your hitting coach is Ryan Tuntland. Tip Keister was the bench coach. And... Your developmental coach, Kawika Emsley Pai. In his second year coaching in the professional ranks, moved up from Frisco from High A Hickory, along with fellow coaches Cardoza, Goebel, and Tuntlin. Wow, so they all moved up together. Wow. He was the head coach at Centralia college in Washington. Played six years in the minor leagues, reaching all the way up to the double-A level in 2014. Nice. So yeah, the Rough Riders set. I like it. I mean, you got some big names in here. Uh, Carter, Leiter, Spees, guys that made it to the show. I'm sure some of the guys that are in that Stockton Port set, they will be making it to the show very soon. We may see them in Sacramento. We may see them in Vegas. We may see them wherever they get traded to or sign with after. All right. Well, hey, Minor League Monday. Go out, see some Minor League games, get some cards from the stadium. They're fun to look at, the different ball players that you can get. Um, it's once again, as I've said before, it's a great way to track history of your favorite team or baseball in just general. Minor League Monday. We'll have some more for you next week and we'll have some fun tomorrow on Tuesday. Remember to like, share, subscribe, and follow Boss Man Sports Cards and Box Score Collectibles here on YouTube, out on Instagram. And Facebook, uh, TikTok, all that good stuff. All right. Have a great rest of your Monday. Boss Man here. Boss Man Sports Cards. Boss Man out.